Hi, in this lesson, we will introduce you to an important process called File I.O. When we need to output data in our programs, we use print to show output in the terminal. When we need to access data in our programs, we use variables, lists, and get input from users. Sometimes we want to be able to store and read from information that is located outside of our programs. Being able to open, close, read from, and write to files is a powerful technique in coding languages that is typically referred to as file input and output, or file I.O. File input is the process of receiving or reading data from a file into a computer program for further processing or use. File output is the process of sending or writing data from a computer program to a file for storage or future use. We can think about reading from a file as getting sound input, like speaking into a microphone. We can think about writing to a file like sound output, like playing a song out of your speakers. A file is like a container that holds different types of information on a computer. It can store things like text, pictures, music, videos, or programs. Just like you have folders to organize your papers, files are organized in folders on a computer to keep them neat and easy to find. You can create, open, and save files using different software or apps. Files are important because they help us store and access our information and media on computers and other digital devices. Files come in different formats that hold different kinds of information. For example, a plain text file, TXT, is used for basic written text. MP3 files store music or other audio recordings. MOV files are used for videos. CSV files are used for organizing data in tables, like in a spreadsheet. Each format is designed to work well with specific types of information and can be opened or played using different software or apps. One of the most common file formats we will use in File I.O. is a TXT file. A TXT file is a type of file that contains plain, readable text without any special formatting. Another very common file format we will use in File I.O. is a CSV file. A CSV, short for Comma Separated Values file, is a plain text file format used to store tabular data, such as spreadsheet or database information. In a CSV file, each line typically represents a single row of data, and the values within a row are separated by commas, hence the name comma separated values. Let's explore some real-world programs that use file I.O.